What? You're not putting that stuff in my bag. Why? I'll do it. Holy crap, does it really matter? Yeah. Of what it is like trying to pack with three children. Are you excited? <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Okay. Good morning guys. It is the day before we leave to go to Sydney and this is a reality of what it is like trying to pack with three children. Oh, <laughs> it's so hectic. So I started trying yesterday and I feel like I was like, sweet, I'm gonna get it all done. I'm gonna have the three kids at home. Every two seconds I would go to something like, mom, I need this, mom, where's this? Mom, can you make me food? Mom, I'm hungry, I wanna go outside. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm going to lose my mind and we've not even left yet. Anyways, we've had a start on it yesterday. As you guys can see here, like I said, it was not an easy, I think this took me like, how many hours was I walking around doing this for? The worst thing was yesterday, it was so, Messy from Christmas. I know, stuff everywhere. I've written two lists, guys. The first one here has got like all the bits and pieces I could think of. And then the second one has got like all the last minute things that we need to grab. So, our flight tomorrow is at seven o'clock. We live around about half an hour away from the plane and we need to be there early. So, we're gonna be leaving home at 5 a.m. So, I'm gonna be getting up at like 3 4 o'clock in the morning because I'm just so worried about forgetting something. And I was saying to Kurt, I was like, it's not even the fact of forgetting like the things that we can get when we get there. Like, if I forgot my makeup or something like that, like you could just go to the shops and get what you need to get. But it's like the fact of forgetting the things that are gonna make the day tomorrow run as smooth as possible. I have my expectations set low because I know traveling with three kids is going to be a little bit chaotic but I'm like if I can make it as easy as possible then that's the plan I'm gonna have mine real low you know, today she's real low. <laughs> I think they'll be fine but it's just like if flights are delayed or things like that happen I want to make sure obviously I have got like a bottle ready for Regi I want to make sure that I've got like her blankies there just like the bits and pieces that like she needs it's just like basically her necessities because i know like we're supposed to land whatever time but just in case things happen no, no, no. Anything, can happen. anything can happen so like you know just trying to think about like think it through and be like okay what do i need if the flight gets delayed that's pretty much where my head is at this is the virgo and me coming out but there's a lot i'm so excited i am honestly like so excited the kids First time ever being on a plane tomorrow. They're going to love it. So excited to go see Freddie and Maddie. And yeah, it's just gonna be an awesome trip. But yes, it's a big job, guys. I need to have a coffee before I start this. <laughs> in a very aesthetically pleasing zip. <laughs> Guys, kids are all packed. I see you chop their tags off and I might, um, I'll actually write their names on it too. So for Fred, because Fred's gonna be picking them up for us. So kids bags, ready to go. We've got this little bag for carry-on. Just bits and pieces in there. Got their clothes ready for the morning. Now it's just Kurt and I finishing packing our stuff and we're ready to go for tomorrow. <laughs> Are you excited? <laughs> I'm so excited. It's gonna be a fun day today. But mom, it's <laughs> not it's not daytime. No, it's not time. I know, I told you we had to get up super early. It's still black outside. Still pitch black guys. It's been up for an hour. And we're all ready to go. Literally just gonna get ready up in a couple minutes and then head out. Are we going on a plane? We scary. Is that scary? Is that scary? Are you scared? It's okay, come here. We're in the car heading off now. I'm so excited. When was the last time we went to Sydney go? Long time. Before kids. BC. Before child. We're probably gonna see a beautiful sunrise on the way there too. Guys, we're here. We're turning into the airport now. Sydney, here we come. Now we've got to figure out where we can park. 
Regan's my gorgeous. She's go your away, gorgeous. Away, go away, we're going to the plane rigs. Yeah. Tell me, go away, go away, mummy. Is there a combo here, though? Yeah. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Daddy, can't pick up daddy, daddy pushing Graham. Mummy, yeah. mummy. Oh my gosh, Regs, who do you want, mummy or daddy? It's good. I so, I've never, ever, ever, ever been on the plane. It says Jet Star. Do, 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 that is, they'll say Bye bye, baby. Bye bye. Okay. Look at Link. Which one's your favourite? Um, but Link, look how big that one is. Well, yeah, but no. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Did you get the window seat? <laughs> <laughs> How do the people know when we run? Mean no, we can just say, excuse me. In front of you. If your seat has a leg rest or device holder, ensure they are stowed. Wow, oh, We are going to say it's going to go really fast first, and then we go up. And then super duper fast, and then up. Yep. So, but we're not doing it just yet. First, we're just going for a little stroll, and then we're going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly right. We're going to get in position first. There it goes. <laughs> We're going up, mate. We're going up. What's happening with your ears? Um, I pop, my ears are a bit weird and I popped that one but I can't <laughs> pop that one. You gonna hold my hand Link? Are you good? Sorry if it's very echoey, I'm currently in the bathroom, but it has been so go, 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 which is awesome because everything ran so smoothly. Everything was like on time. We got straight off the flight, 
but then the train came like three minutes later then straight from there we pulled up and Freddie and Maddie were back here and like it's just been really nice and busy Rigi did amazing we were so worried about traveling with her like being that little bit younger how she would go but honestly she was incredible the other two have had such a fun day she ended up having a little nap in the pram which is great the best thing we did is we actually put the kids to bed early last night so we put them down like an hour earlier than usual and they all just were already awake when we got them up earlier this morning which is so good as you guys saw we ended up going to the botanical gardens and when we were there we got some very very exciting news as you guys saw Kurt's brother and his girlfriend Maddie are having a baby and we are just like so excited and happy for them. So what great news. Now we're just so excited to enjoy the next few days here. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys soon.